did I, did, should I, should I just tell the story? I'm going to tell the story. <laughs> he likes stuff like this, especially when people don't have any idea. Okay. Okay. So check this out. Brandy and I were friends in the beginning. Um, her mother um, and, and reached out to me, uh, as well as my manager reached out to Brandy, uh, because Brandy was a big fan of, of mine. And um, I was, you know, I was like, wow, that's amazing, because this, this uh, young lady was pretty cool. Now, I'm, I'm, I was young at the time. I wasn't 30 nothing, you know what I'm saying? So don't, don't get it twisted. Hold on one second. Can, can we keep it down? Because I can't, I can't have, all right? So um, what happened is we actually, you know, she became kind of like my little protege, you know what I mean? I'm the, actually the one that um, introduced her to Vita Spears and, and Ralph they came to us to actually do a, a TV show on the UPN network. And um, I said, well, you know, Brandy's down the hallway and, you know, she's basically, uh, she was on the Thea show. Okay, cool. Introduced her to that. The, the show came uh, uh, to fruition. My mom and I wrote the, the theme song to the Brandy show. So Brandy and I were really, really close. Uh, once she turned of age, we had been hanging around each other so much. We've been hanging around each other so much that there became to be some sort of connection, an intimate connection. We actually fell in love. Now, we were young. That's what happens. You're young and you fall in love. You know what I'm saying? Especially when you have the ability to be around somebody a lot, you begin to know things about them. You know what I mean? And they know things about you. Now, when you're young, you make decisions based on your youth. You know what I'm saying? You don't make decisions, uh, 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 moral decisions that put you in a whole position where you know that this is what's going to be for the rest of your life. You're learning through everything. And uh, Brandy and I learned through a lot. When it came time for Brandy to go on her prom, she was my girlfriend. Uh, um, Kobe Bryant, Kobe Bryant was in was was graduating from high school that year. Brandy was my girlfriend. She had just graduated from Pepperdine, and her mom and I, we both made it so that Brandy was ever was able to go on tour. I mean, on on uh, the prom with Kobe Bryant. Okay, when it came time for Brandy to introduce herself to the world, I'm the one that actually put her on the Boys to Mentor. Okay, so she was with me. You know, she was my friend, and we became intimate as a re in a relationship. There's no lie going on here. You can ask Brandy. She will tell you the same story. Relax on what you think, because I know, because I lived it, and so did Brandy. As time progressed, we grew out of each other. Yes. It was a hurtful thing. It was a hurtful thing to break up. That's what happens. You're in a relationship and then you break up. She grew out of me and I grew out of her. Might have grown out of her a little bit faster, but you know, it's a relationship. You're young and you make decisions. Next thing you know, that's what it is. Brandy's successful, boys to men is successful, and we're happy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> this this is what it is. We are happy so whoever is there saying you know all kinds of crazy stuff like they know you know what i mean regardless of anything up. my age her mother was definitely you know a, a part of our relation a very her mother and father was a part of our relationship they allowed me to to guide brandy and to help her through her career they understood that we had grown close and that's what it was you know what i'm saying so understand that un that you know for a fact, whoever it is on there, that life happens. That's just what it is. So now you have your answer and you have your understanding. If you care to listen, you care to believe it, I don't care. I know the truth and now everybody else does too. All right, so now let's move on to the next contestant. Yay. <laughs> that was awesome, right? Yay, now Jay, thank you. Now, sometimes you just got to put it out there so that